First, we're going to talk about the requirements for the external hard drive. It has to be USB 3 or later, and it has to have a minimum of 250 gigs and a maximum of 8 terabytes capacity. Now, you only can use one external hard drive at a time. If you try to use two, you'll get an error message. So only use one at a time. PS4 had licensed a Seagate external hard drive as the official external hard drive for the PS4, but you can use any external hard drive long as long as it meets the requirements, especially at a 3.0. I'm going to show you how you can move a game to that external storage. So let's start from the beginning. From the beginning, what you do is you go to settings, you go to storage. Now you go where the game is. So you click in system storage, click in applications, and I want to say let's go Black Ops 4. So what you do is you press the option button. As soon as you press the option button, this will come up. Move to extended storage. You'll press X on that. And then you can select which games or select all and move all of them to your hard drive. What I'm going to do is just select one for now. So let's say Call of Duty 4 Black Ops. I selected it. Now I'm going to go over here to move. Press move. And then it's going to ask me, do I want to move the selected application? I'm going to press OK. As soon as you do that, it'll start trying to move from the PlayStation to the extended hard drive, which takes less time than actually downloading the actual game. You see that says 25 minutes. Now, if you was downloading the game, it would say it was at first, it would say like three uh, uh, to five hours, I would say. 